everyone, and it's that time of year again for an annual tradition involving the Lake Lunatair Elementary School. Of course, we're talking about the annual soup supper that's a big fundraiser for the school. And I have a couple of special guests with us today. I'm going to have you guys introduce yourselves. Tell us your name and uh, what grade you're in. I'm Jacek, and I'm in fifth grade. Jacek? Mm -hmm. Okay. And I'm Delilah, and I'm in fifth grade. Delilah and Jacek, both from the fifth grade at uh, Lake Elementary uh, School. And of course, fifth grade is the highest grade you can be in at the elementary before you move on to middle school. Um, so we've got the soup supper coming up. Um, before we get to that, how long have you guys been at Lake Minotaur? Since kindergarten. kindergarten. Seven years. Seven years? Yeah. That's a, it's quite a long time in one school. Yeah, quite a bit of time, huh? So you you guys have been involved in the in the soup supper a little bit, quite a bit before, haven't you? Mm-hmm. Yeah. So uh, give us a few of the details of, of when it is and, and uh, the time and everything. It's Saturday, January 25th. Okay. And what time? 5 to 8 p.m. So it goes from 5 to 8 o'clock at Lake Minotaur Elementary School. Mm -hmm. um, so what are we what are we going to have on the menu? Chili, chicken noodle soup, and a new loaded baked potato. Ooh, is that that's new? Yes. Wow. So who yeah. came who came up with the idea of loaded baked potato? I don't. You don't know. know. <laughs> one one of one of the mom and dads out there uh, just mm -hmm. kind of came up with the idea. Hey, let's throw yeah. loaded baked potato on there. That's not a bad idea. Loaded baked potato is kind of a popular soup out there, isn't it? Yeah. Uh, do you like loaded baked potato? I like mm -hmm. loaded baked potatoes. You do? Yeah. Well, potatoes. What about the soup? I've never had it. Oh, okay. Well, how about you? No. No? No, you don't like it? No, you've never no, had I it? No, I've never had it. Oh, okay. So you, do you guys get the opportunity to try some of the soups out there? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah? Okay. Um, so explain a little bit of what happens at the soup supper, because I know there's a little bit more than just that. There's raffles, um, silent oxen, and you get to talk with everybody in People will have food out for you. Okay, and and for the raffle and the silent auction, do you know what kind of prizes are out there? Do you? There is a 65 inch 4K smart TV. Ooh, nice, very nice. That'd be that'd be a nice one to play games on, wouldn't it? Mm-hmm. Uh huh. Yeah. <laughs> Jason's big smile on his face uh, talking about that one, huh? Yeah, I would I wouldn't mind that myself actually. Um, what other kind of things? Um. There's baskets from every single classroom. Okay. And other donations, I'm assuming, from businesses as yes. well. Mm -hmm. Things like gift cards and things such as that. Yep. And, <laughs> and of course, uh, the silent auction goes throughout the entire the entire uh, evening. Of course, so you have time to, a yep. cutoff time at the end for people to get signed up for that and hopefully get the item yep. that they want to get. And of course, the raffles. Um, what, are, uh, what are the ticket prices for the raffles? Um, it's okay. Do you recall, Jacek, what the what the prices on the raffle tickets? Mm -mm. Okay. Well, they're they're not going to be extremely expensive, mm -hmm. obviously. Um, and of course, there's a whole lot more that's going to be going on at the Lake Minotaur Soup Supper. And we'll be right back in a moment and tell you about that. And we're back talking about the Lake Minotaur Soup Supper that's coming up at Lake Minotaur Elementary School uh, from uh, 5 to 8 o'clock in the evening, Saturday, Saturday, January 25th. I have Jacek and Delilah with me, and and uh, you guys are, I tell you what, this is not easy stuff to remember, is it? No. You're doing great. <laughs> You're doing great. So explain a little bit for the folks what the money goes to that's um, raised through this. The money goes to field trips and and other things that mm -hmm. um, that you might yeah. need at the school as well. Yes. Yep. Yeah, and uh, of course, um, the other thing to remember is that this originally uh, was a big fundraiser for Lake Minotaur when it was a school all of its own, right? There's a little yeah. bit of history in that. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, now with the the uh, silent auction and, and things, there's a there's one big, really big item, isn't there? Yeah, the Green Mountain mm -hmm. Smoker. Green Mountain Smoker. Yeah, that's kind of cool. And of course, a 50-50 raffle. Yeah. And uh, we did get the, the ticket prices confirmed. They're usually a, a dollar a piece as far as the raffle's concerned, yep. mm -hmm. or six for five and uh, a dozen uh, for for 10. 
And so there's a little bit of a break if you if you want to get uh, additional ones, of course. So what do you guys end up doing throughout the course of of the evening? Because I know you guys are going to be busy. Yeah, there's going to be volunteers helping out with the food and serving, serving and cleaning up tables. Mm -hmm. Now, did you guys do that last year uh, previously as far as helping yep. clean up and mm -hmm. all that stuff? Yep. Um, what was it like to, to be involved that way? It was really fun mm -hmm. for me because I did, did help out last year. How about you, Jason? No, I had to go to my dad's. Oh, you had to go to your dad's? Oh, mm -hmm. okay. So you missed out on the fun, but you're going yep. to be involved this year, huh? Probably. Probably, yeah. And uh, so the tickets uh, for the soup supper are how much? Um, for adults, they're, I think, $6. And, and then for kids, 4 to 11 they're half of that price? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Three. And, and kids under 4 obviously, are, are free to mm -hmm. uh, free to take part in the soup supper there at Lake Minotaur Elementary. And, and then, of course, the big question that people are going to have, if they haven't gotten them already, because if you go out driving near Lake Minotaur School, anywhere along Highland Road, you see the signs. Yep. So the question is, how do people get tickets to attend? Um, there's flyers all around the town. <laughs> and you can get them from any Lake Minotaur student. OK. Uh, is that the only way? Or can you get them? Get you them can outside? get them at the night of the soup supper at the front door. Okay, and I guess you can also uh, call the school as well to find mm -hmm. out. Uh, maybe even stop by and pick up tickets. And the number for the school is seven eight three one one three four for the uh, Lake Lake Minotaur Soup Supper, which is an annual tradition here in the valley. Been going on for gosh decades. I did. You know, I grew up in the area, and I don't even remember a time back into the 70s when it didn't even uh, when it didn't take place. So it's coming up on the 25th of January, from five until eight o'clock at Lake Minotaur School. Jasek, Delilah, you guys have done great. Thank Thanks. you very much for joining us today. Mm -hmm.